Hi, I'm Ken Heck, President of Phase Technology. I'd like to tell you a little bit about our PC series of speakers. One of the most obvious uh, differences between the PC and conventional speakers are the solid piston drivers. If you look at the front of it, you notice that it's a flat disc that's in the same plane as the front surface of the cabinet. And there's a lot of advantages to a solid piston driver. Let me tell you about them. I'm going to take this woofer apart and magically show you the back. If you notice, the cone has a, a flat surface, but the back of it is in the shape of a regular cone. It's a molded material, and it's actually molded as a solid piece of material. And you might look at it and say, well, that looks pretty heavy. Well, in fact, the cone itself weighs only 3.1 grams. A uh, conventional polypropylene cone probably weighs about 7 grams, so this, this is about half the weight, which means that it can move very quickly and very accurately. Uh, the other thing that we do with them is we have Kevlar that we use as a coating on the back of the cone and glass fiber as a coating on the front. And what this does is it gives us a really nice surface for the, um, the solid piston to move from and it gives us a very smooth mid-range. Uh, conventional cones, because they're made of a very thin material, have a couple disadvantages. Uh, one of them is that the way that they reproduce mid-band frequencies is they go into what's called a breakup mode, where the actual cone itself is moving, the center of it is moving at a different frequency than the rest of the cone. Uh, the solid piston can't do that. They can't break up. So the whole thing always moves as one unit which gives you a much clearer, cleaner signal or sound. The other advantage of a solid piston is that all the sounds emanate from this front surface. So they're naturally aligned in the time domain with the tweeter and the mid-range. You can see that all of them are in the same surface plane. Uh, on a lot of speakers, you'll notice that they're tilted back uh, in order to accomplish the same thing that we can accomplish just mounting a solid piston driver. One of the other big things that you notice is the size of the magnet structure on these things is huge. A conventional speaker, the magnet structure is much, much smaller. And what this gives us, it gives us added control. The bigger the magnet structure, the more force in the uh, gap where the voice call moves. And the more force you have there, the more accurate the driver can move. So these reproduce the combination of a light cone and a very high uh, force factor in the magnetic field produce sounds that are extremely accurate. One of the other unique features of the, uh, the PC series is the rounded or curved sides. Uh, it makes for a very, very rigid cabinet. And the reason why you want a rigid cabinet is because when this thing is reproducing sound, it's reproducing as much sound in this direction as it's reproducing inside the cabinet. And all those sounds inside the cabinet tend to vibrate the cabinet surface itself. So by having this radius here, it makes for a very rigid structure. And then using 3 quarter inch MDF, it makes for a very non-resonant cabinet. So the cabinet's not adding anything to the overall sound of the speaker. It makes the speaker sound much better. A minute ago I was talking about the sound that comes into the room. But when a driver reproduces sound, just as much sound goes behind and into the cabinet as comes out into the room. It's an equal amount of energy. All that sound inside the cabinet has to bounce around and, and dissipate and go somewhere. With a conventional driver, like a polypropylene or paper or even aluminum woofer, they're very thin materials. So those sound waves that are inside the cabinet, all that energy tends to come out right through that thin material and mix with the front wave. Not a good thing. What happens with those back waves is they're out of phase with the front waves and it causes the sound to be very muddied and unclear. With the solid piston woofers, the thickness of the driver and the material that we make them from make them acoustically opaque so the sound can't travel through the, the cone and mix with the front waves.